Inside a cell, not everything is busy with constant reactions. Some structures are built to store, protect, and balance. Vacuoles are one of them. They look like simple fluid-filled sacs, but in reality, they are essential for the life of a cell. In plant cells, the central vacuole can occupy more than half of the cell's volume. It is filled with water, ions, and dissolved substances. By adjusting how much water it holds, the vacuole creates pressure, called turgor pressure, that pushes against the cell wall and keeps the plant upright. Without it, leaves would wilt, and stems would collapse. But vacuoles are more than just water tanks. They store nutrients, pigments, and even toxins that defend the cell against herbivores and microbes. In seeds, vacuoles can hold proteins and oils that nourish the embryo when it begins to grow. In petals, pigments inside vacuoles give flowers their striking colors. Animal cells also have vacuole-like structures, though smaller. Protozoa such as paramecium contain contractile vacuoles that pump out excess water, preventing the cell from bursting. This constant regulation shows how vital vacuoles are for survival. Even waste disposal can happen here. Harmful byproducts are isolated inside vacuoles, keeping the rest of the cytoplasm safe. So while vacuoles may look like empty spaces, they are in fact powerful regulators of balance, storage, and defense. In plants, they provide rigidity. In proteists, they ensure survival. Across life, they reveal that even storage is an active, life-sustaining function.